Greetings, Game Rule fans, another exciting review for you. This time a blasty for under pass, Steve Salancelot and the Amstrad CPC 464. Blooming dead good game this. Anyway, that's you, Salancelot there. I've, uh, I've cheated with the retro theme a bit. I've configured my Xbox controller to play it. Anyway, uh, anyway, you've got all these different levels. One, two, three, four, I'm pointing. You can count any of them flashing axings there to get into level. Let's go, let's go on this one. Nice sweet sound there of a swooning princess. I should imagine. I don't know if that is true actually. I think, it's, I think that's just uh, or something I just made up. Anyway, you've got to collect all these things to uh, get on to the next le level. So, uh, oh, blum it. Yeah, so, so Lancelot. Oh, blum it. I, I can't get up there from there. I'm going to go all over here again. It's a. Uh, it's a. Uh, it's a classic, this is, and uh, it's highly underrated. Not many people have heard of it. Oh, I love it. Blum brilliant. Now it's just out there so we can get out. Nice little flashing special effect there, make it a bit more exciting. Let's go up here, let's take this one up here. Look at that, look at that, it's blooming evil. Yeah, I'm not done there. A blasty from the past. <laughs> yes, gaming mill skill. I've not done a, a blasty from the pasty for quite quite some long time because um, I've been doing all them other blooming new games like uh, well you've seen them well no if you probably haven't seen them because everyone's stopped watching my blooming channel uh, yeah so oh, blooming it, it's, it's well trick I'm concentrating too hard game mill skill I'm doing really well on this at this rate. I've completed. Uh, got nothing better to do on a Friday night than play on a blooming game from the eighties. Nothing wrong with that. It's all good fun. Uh, hey, guess what? My smoking brother is in is in blooming Denmark. I've just been speaking to him a minute ago on the. Uh, on FaceTime thing and um, he didn't really have a lot to say. Pac-Man at the top there. I'm sure that was licensed. Uh, I've got blooming hiccups. Like every time I blooming come on here I get blooming hiccups. Lazy Jess is still not speaking to me. I don't know what's up with her. Red Michael and Randy Andy are. Red Michael's a blooming weirdo. Oh, blooming it. Hey, look at that nice animation there of him dying. Going straight up to heaven. I don't know what the storyline is behind this game. Red, that's, that's Red Michael. He thought the storyline was about, and uh, he just started talking about dodgems, you know, bumper cars at the blooming fairground. He was going on about them because he's right. In. I told him that the ah, uh, oh, didn't do that music last time. No, because I, I told him it was a bit of a joke. We were looking at why is he going so for? Blooming fast. I told him that he was looking at him at the fair a couple of years ago, and I told him that the uh, see, you know, the wheels on them red Michael, not the wheels, but you know, them black things. No, this is what I said. I said, uh, you know, them bumper cars, you see that red, that black ring round them? He goes, Yeah, he's got quite an high voice. I said, uh, it's, you can, that means you can drive them on water. 
Can you? He said. Oh, bloody heck. He's a bloody idiot. But he was talking about it because uh, there's a. F oh, God. Oh, I didn't come that far. Um, yeah, because uh, we're going to. Um, we're on about going. Oh, oh, I've got them all. Oh, blooming heck. What about going to some uh, theme park soon? And um, he's really looking forward to trying it out. How's it? He's not even thought it through. How's he going to get the blooming dodgems off the uh, off the ride anyway? Into some water. Maniac. Oh, I'll go this way. I didn't think of that. Gaming male has skill. What's that? I'm really enjoying this game of milk fans. How far is he going to come? That far. Um, was that my last life? Oh, I hope it's not one of them blooming act versions where you've got infinite lives and all that. Loads of them blooming old games are like that now. Ah, oh. Congratulations both tonight. It's, it's a game of mill. You have proven to be brave and strong in your quest for the Holy Grail and as such I invite you to join me and others who have sought Oh, you can read it yourself. You fought until... Yeah. Give me your name and I shall remember you. Your name tonight. Oh, type it in. Let's have a look, see where I did. Coming really low. Hey, Stephen Cargill, he's the guy that programmed this. Anyway, uh, enough of this. It's a good game. Good old game. Worth having a look, uh, looking out for. Overall, give it 9.5 out of 10. Keep your cut dry. Oh, don't forget to check out my blog as well. There's a link in the uh, description box. See you later, game of fans. Wonga!